This is Pastor Andrew with your scripture of the day. Hopefully I can give you a word to encourage you to encourage someone else. Now this scripture always encourages me. I heard it early on uh, in my walk with God and it encouraged me then and right now I'm hoping that it gives me motivation throughout the rest of the week, year, to just kind of just remember the humbleness that's demonstrated in this set of scripture. It comes from John chapter 1 verses 22 and 23 and they read like this. It says, then they said to him, who are you that we may give an answer to those who sent us? What do you say about yourself? He said, I am the voice of the one crying in the wilderness. Make straight the way of the Lord, as the prophet Isaiah said. Now, this is John the Baptist responding to them, asking him who he is. Now, not for a second did he say that he was the Messiah, that he's the man. He wasn't built up on who he is. Sometimes we can get so caught up on the amount of education we have, what we have in our wallet, all these different things. But at the end of the day, I do know that everything I have is a good and perfect gift from God. And he gave it to me so that I can give him glory. So no matter what comes my way today or, or the rest of this week or whatever, I'm going to be motivated to make a way, you know, and just let everyone know Jesus is coming back. And here's his gospel message. And here's that he loves you and that and that you have the, the chance to know him intimately. That's my purpose. That's all of our purpose. And, you know, those of us who are called by his name. So it just brings me back to a place of humility and on the most basic level without going too deep into it. These scripture, that, that, those two scriptures always remind me that when you're asked and you will be asked, who are you? I always bring it back to that place of humbleness, just saying I'm just a humble servant, just looking to fulfill what, you know, what God says about me. And that's my life purpose. What he calls me to is what I'm going to do. All right. So check this out. Hate can't drop out hate. Only love can do that. Let that also be something that motivates you this week. Love you for listening. Thank you for listening to the scripture of the day.